this is data dot i'm here to talk about uh, clustering in tableau in five minutes um tableau introduced a new feature called clustering k-means clustering uh in new version called tableau uh, version desktop version 10. okay let's see how we can quickly build the clusters uh, based on the features that they uh, provide okay uh, to talk about clustering, clustering is like a, a data analysis method where we can cluster um, attributes, uh, cluster entities with similar attributes together. So clustering has like a lot of applications and let's see uh, what we can, uh, how we can create the clusters in Tableau today in quickly five minutes. So I've just opened a, opened a Tableau sample store data set which will come with any default installation of tableau and um, i'm just going to create a new sheet right and um, this is the tableau superstore data set which comes in with any default installation of tableau even with tableau public um, let's create a scatter plot first i'm going to create a scatter plot based on a pro two measures right now profit and sales right i'm going to not aggregate any measures so that we'll get the scatter plot right let's do okay so these are the data points that we have and we can also display the customer name in the tooltip so that we know what customer is where. So this is the customer who has a sales of 11,000 and we have a profit of 3,000. So let's see how we can quickly create a clusters out of it, right? Go to this analytics pane on the left hand side and then click and drag the clusters here, right? It will give you create clusters just drop there okay so now it gave you a clusters right we have like three clusters um, cluster one right cluster two and cluster three okay cluster one is basically customers with low sales and low profit for example See, their sales is like two thousand dollars, and the profit is negative three thousand seven hundred. So these are the clusters wherein the customers uh, who are like who buy less, and then the, we don't even get profit out of it. It's actually a loss. Okay. And cluster two is like a medium customers with medium profit. Like they have like a sales, medium sales, and then they get like a uh, medium profit. And cluster three is basically uh, customers with higher sales and higher profit so this is somewhat we are interested in so if any new customers come in with higher sales uh, they fall into this cluster so that's all about creating clusters using tableau um, this is a new feature in tableau 10 and we can just add any number of measures into the variable pane of this clusters window and we can also create like we can customize the number of cluster that you want to create so that is also automated so this is very important and very useful feature in earlier versions of tableau we we have to leverage the power of scripting languages like r to create those clusters now it is automated and it's very useful feature um, that's all i have to talk about uh, this clustering in tableau um, i hope you like my video please subscribe to my channel if you want to get more videos thanks a lot bye